In this video, we are going to talk about the top five carbon capture technology breakthroughs. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for future updates. Manufacturing facilities can install equipment that absorbs CO2 before it is released into the atmosphere to reduce emissions. The utilization of carbon capture methods enables the storage of collected carbon underground or the production of carbon-based goods like electrofuels, concrete, and chemicals. A related method called direct air capture DAC, extracts CO2 from the atmosphere for usage or storage. The use of carbon capture and DAC technologies can help the economy achieve net zero emissions, but they cannot scale up to the required level without long-term governmental support to speed up investment and implementation. Environmental justice and other organizations worried about the effects of local land use and air quality, as well as enhanced oil recovery, have voiced some criticism of carbon capture and DAC technologies. Policies must also make sure that deployment results in net zero slash negative emissions overall. Consideration of all air quality and economic effects, particularly those affecting low income and historically disadvantaged communities, should be a part of any long-term policy support for these technologies. Here is the list of the top five carbon capture technology breakthroughs. Let's start. Number five, carbon emissions into minerals or creating carbon-free chemicals. A significant effort is being made to achieve carbon neutrality, which promotes the use of as many technologies as possible to reduce and recycle carbon emissions. Prior to industrial facilities releasing carbon dioxide into the atmosphere, carbon collection and use is a key emissions reduction technology. Minerals and energy that can be reused at industrial sites are produced through improvements in carbon conversion and utilization technology. Number four, bioenergy carbon capture and sequestration using hexus biomass. Another emerging innovation area, along with renewable energy and carbon capture, is attaining negative emissions or eliminating substantial amounts of carbon dioxide from the environment. Companies are able to capture carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and store it underground while simultaneously producing usable biofuels by converting biomass feedstock like agricultural waste into bioenergy. Since it does produce ground pollution, startups are presently addressing several issues with this mitigation technique. Less carbon will, however, bury itself as more polluting organizations start to use bioenergy fuels. A U.S.-based firm called Hexus Biomass creates and markets sustainable non-wood biomass feedstock. Perennial xano grass grows quickly and produces 15 to 25 dry tons of biomass per acre annually. Number 3. Deep Ranch Biotech – Recycling of Carbon there are already a number of underground carbon dioxide storage systems. However, there are increasing chances to absorb carbon emissions and transform them into useful fuels or other substitutes. For instance, ethanol is a useful petrochemical that can be created from recycling carbon and is used in a variety of sectors. With the use of such technologies, businesses can become carbon neutral without drastically altering their business procedures. Number 2. Carbon Emissions into Industrial Hemp Industrial hemp has a wide range of uses, including those for paper, textiles, biodegradable polymers, building materials, food, and fuel. Hemp now offers tremendous value for commercial carbon capture as one of the fastest-growing biomasses. Hemp is also effective at protecting against potentially dangerous compounds like dioxins, which are carcinogenic and cause deforestation, as well as the accumulation of plastics and cosmetics, the majority of which require fossil fuels and are difficult to decompose. Number 1. View Carbon Emissions to Fuel at O2 Energy One of the numerous technologies needed to achieve the world's climate goals is the technology for capturing and storing carbon dioxide. This removes greenhouse gases from the atmosphere. With the use of this technology, carbon emissions from burning fossil fuels and industrial operations might be greatly reduced. One method to do this is to convert greenhouse gases into different fuels that can then be utilized to produce power or heat. Today's startups develop energy technology that transforms electricity into gas or other fuels. A Canadian firm called CO2 Energy 
is employing reversible fuel cell technology to effectively transform carbon dioxide and water into commercial and environmentally friendly value-added goods. In order to facilitate the electrochemical conversion of water to hydrogen and carbon dioxide to carbon monoxide, the firm is creating reversible solid oxide fuel cells. Syngas, a combination of carbon monoxide and hydrogen, is created as a result. With the use of this method, carbon may be efficiently captured and used to create fuels, electricity, heat, and oxygen. That's it for today. We hope you found our video interesting. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and share it with others. Also, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to our channel. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of our new uploads. In the end, thanks for watching and see you next time.